Americans awoke to headlines of a never-ending election today to learn the finish line had been moved to Florida. The race had become a real political who won it. Oh, I knew it would be close. I'm surprised they didn't know by now with all the computers and all. And from Manhattan to Malibu, voters tried to make sense of the historic moment. Uh, the voter turnout was unprecedented, and I think it just brought a lot of young people into the process to make them realize that it's not all uh, decided by the, the guys in the back room anymore. In San Francisco. I think it's pretty awesome. I mean, I think it's really great that we actually have finally had a, a very, very close race like this. Fred Holden said the country's uh, been through sure worse. Goes, but I guess I've been around long enough to realize that the system's very strong. And no matter which way it goes, things will keep going on. In Oregon, site of the nation's first all-mail-in vote, where the race is also too close to call, Gore supporter Beth Boston was impatient for the Florida results. And I'm like, you know, grab some temp workers or something, because yeah. this is like everyone's waiting and no one knows how long it's going to take. And Bush voter Mark Hansen agreed the uncertainty is unsettling. And it's almost like uh, a death in the family without closure. It was in St. Louis a half century ago that Harry Truman had the real last word, where last night voting went into overtime because of crowded polls. And this morning, Anna Warfield was uneasy. But then when I got up this morning and, and saw that it wasn't over yet, it kind of makes me nervous. But for some, it was also reassuring. An old political truth had been reaffirmed. People who traditionally don't vote do so because they feel like their vote doesn't count. And I think that they're dead wrong. I mean, everything about this election gripped the nation precisely because of the fact that everybody's vote did count. This continuing political drama is the stuff of novels or a Hollywood film. But in this case, you can't skip ahead or fast forward to the end. The reality is we just have to wait until the counting is done.